Hello there. Today we are going to be checking out Scream Fest at Kennebee Lake Park in New Hampshire. So let's go. Before we go over to Kennebee Lake Park, we stopped at Burger King and Adam's going to try the new Ghost Pepper Whopper. I, on the other hand, am just having a regular Whopper because I can't really do spicy. But we'll see what he thinks of it. Ooh, look at that. Now, despite the name, it doesn't have ghost peppers on it. It has ghost pepper queso and jalapenos. So it's still too spicy for me, but it looks great. Look how orange it is. So orange. So what's the verdict? Oh, it's very tasty. Spicy? I like a little bit. Yeah. yeah. So, so very spicy. That's because, yeah, spicy. Yeah, it's got some heat to it. It's yeah. nice. Very. It's a, it's a fun variation. Very, very, very spicy. All right, done with lunch, we're gonna head over. I just wanted to give a quick warning that when we get to the park, there will be some scary monsters, gory scenes, and flashing lights. So if that's not for you, you may wanna click off and check out one of our other videos. Okay, on to the park. So we have made it to Canopy Lake Park in Salem, New Hampshire. We've actually only been here one other time and it was the summer and we came kind of late in the day. So we actually haven't seen like everything in the park, but we had a good time that time, hoping Scream Fest will be great as well. Um, they have like a lot of like family rides and just a couple thrill coaster kind of things. But I think um, the Halloween offerings seem like they'll be pretty good. There's five different haunts. They do a little monster parade. Um, so it should be fun, should be lots of fun. Thank you for visiting with us and enjoy your day at Canopy Lake Park. So we decided to get the Scream Express Pass for the haunts. Um, it was only 25 bucks a person, so that was nice. I don't think the house is open until later though, so for now we're gonna try to do some rides. I like how while you wait, they have facts about uh, Mr. Ferris and the Ferris wheel. this once before. Not very spooky, but kind of fun. I did not remember. 
remember getting wet last time. <laughs> because there were definitely things I did not remember from that ride, but it was really good, very fun. <laughs> okay, no, I have to, I have to play because look at State Puck, Climber. Oh my God, the most Crusters car. I love claw machines. Oh my God. All right, cry for the car. Nothing looking. Um, oh, no, that's not gonna work. All right, let me try, let me try State Puck. He's so close. insane claw machine I've ever seen in my life. I probably won't win anything, but I have to play just because it's so insane. parade at 5 45 so we're gonna hang out by the psychodrome which is where they come out and see if we can see some monsters
else is gonna go on at the front gate where it ends. towards the uh, indoor houses, so because it's still kind of light out, we're going to try to do those. We're trying to put some footage in for the houses, probably not everything, just in case you come, don't want to spoil it, but um, yeah, I'll probably try to uh, show you some of the haunts. Oh, and just a warning uh, going into the haunt, so there are some strobe lighting, so if you have any issues with seizures or anything, uh, definitely uh, skip ahead or just click off the video. Uh, there are some strobe lights in there. So much I need to find them.
reaction, I guess. Oh my god. Oh god, oh god, oh, ah, hello. <laughs> So we got in like right away. Um, yeah, they're really, really good, really fun. Um, yeah. everything while it's all lit up now that it's dark. the wait is very long, so I don't know if we'll get to do it tonight. <laughs> Alright. Wow, so yeah. Pretty long line. Good thing we got those express passes. Oh, 
Did not see that coming. Oh. Okay, all right. both got the chicken burrito which I opened up a little bit because they put some hots on it and I cannot do spicy uh, and then we're gonna share the chips and salsa and uh, pretty good portion for the price so the burrito's pretty good I mean um, like we have some pretty good Mexican places by us that are amazing so I mean it's, it's but it's like fine for uh, theme park food especially you know not typically something you could get uh, in your afternoon park so it's nice to uh, have the option and it's very tasty um, and like I said, pretty good portion. The chips are a little salty, but they, again, give you a pretty good portion. So, playing a play, very good. Oh my goodness. Oh my. Big. Big spider.
just got in line for our last house tonight, uh, Cargo. It's a new house for this year. This is actually the first time we haven't walked right in. So, so far, uh, the express pass has been very much worth it. Okay, yeah, uh, there barely was a line for this one, too. <laughs>
lemonade. So we'll try it. Just like regular lemonade, but very good. Well, they close in about 15 minutes. It's 10:45, uh, so we are gonna start making our way to the car. All right. Well, we just made it back to the car, and I think that, that is gonna do it for us today. Uh, overall, we had a really great time at Scream Fest. I really liked the haunted houses. That was great. The Express Pass was definitely worth it. We got to do a lot of the rides. Most of the wait times for the rides we did were only like 20, 30 minutes. Uh, but we didn't get to do either of the roller coasters because those waits were like crazy long all night. If I wanted to do those, I'd probably try to get here like a little before they opened and like just run straight over there. But we were, we came in at like 3.30 and they opened at 3.00. Uh, we stayed the whole time. They were open 3 to 11 on Saturday, and it was great. We really made the most of our time, and I uh, think I would definitely come back. Fun time. So when you are ready to pull in your trip to New England, definitely feel free to reach out to me, uh, Tracy Sylvia, with Key to the World Travel. And uh, we'll see you real soon. Bye.